everybody, it's Taylor here, and I'm about to cook tortilla soup and give you my recipe. Um, so I actually went on and saw the Weight Watchers recipe, but I've kind of done my own thing. So um, if you really want to watch your weight, then go to Weight Watchers. Uh, but if you want to know my recipe, you know, uh, fall is coming and winter's coming. And so I love soups. And so um, also our, I went and purchased a lot of meat from Costco. And then I had to go out of town for some family stuff. And so I had to figure out how I could use my meats ASAP so they wouldn't ruin. Um, so yes, I'm using a ground turkey as well as uh, organic chicken. And so this should be really good. Here are some of the ingredients that you'll need. You need corn, tomato sauce, a can of tomato sauce, two uh, rotels, uh, let's see, um, the original taco. You can do whatever brand you want. Um, it's like a taco seasoning mix. You got ranch seasoning mix. This is spicy, which is actually not what I prefer, but it's all that they had, so I'm gonna use that. Um, do a little bit more chicken broth, just in case I need more. A can of black beans. You can also use pinto beans if you want. And like I mentioned before, you could do um, ground turkey or chicken or ground beef, whatever meat of your choice. And then I'm gonna use this fajita seasoning to do the meat on. And then also you can do salt and pepper. So first I just took ground turkey and onions, a whole onion, and I cooked it on the stove. And then I boiled some chicken and I actually used scissors. Some people think that's funny. I say it's smart and easy. And I just went in and literally cut the chicken up. <laughs> this is my left hand, I'm not left handed, but um, I cut it all up. And so now I have chicken broth, I have chicken, and I have ground turkey, and I'm gonna actually combine it all into one. Alrighty, so I have my crock pot. I'm not gonna turn it on yet. Actually, I will turn it on. I'm gonna go ahead and turn it on high. And then I'm gonna take my boiled chicken with the chicken broth and I'm gonna pour it all in here. So this is about, I would say, three to four chicken breasts. It's gonna be good. And I'm gonna take the ground turkey and onions that are already cooked. I'm going to pour them in the crock pot. I'm excited. Plenty of meat, which is awesome. And I am gonna add more um, chicken broth. I wasn't sure if I was going to, but I think that's a lot of meat, so I think I should. So I have organic chicken broth to pour. Good and gather brand, so healthy. Check the expiration, It's good. Pour that in. Y'all, this is gonna be so good. That looks like it should be enough. Then I'm gonna take, I have, um, instead of doing can, I have the frozen corn, it's sweet. And I'm just gonna, I'm, not even, I'm gonna cook it while it sits in the crock, but I'm not actually gonna cook it before. There's the corn. Um, then I'm gonna take the ranch seasoning. Rotel, actually. Beans, black beans. I'm gonna do the Hunt's tomato sauce. Actually be Final ingredient. Okay, so you see how full it is? I'm gonna do this slow, but I've turned it on high and I'm gonna just stir all the ingredients together. You can see this is super easy. I have the crock pot on high and I'm just gonna let it cook for about, honestly, like 45 minutes to an hour and just let it sit. I'll come in and occasionally stir it. Um, but overall, y'all, this is super easy. 
and I will let you know how it tastes in just a bit. Okay, so I was cooking the soup on high and I did it for about 45 minutes and it was warm, but I tasted it and it actually wasn't, um, it just didn't taste good, it tastes very watery. So I put it on low and I let it cook for about four to six hours. And after the four to six hours, it was so good. So the longer you let it sit, um, it actually soaks up all of the, the different tastes, the different seasonings, and it is so delicious. So what I usually do is I'll add Fritos um, to it and with some grated cheese, y'all, and you will have the best tortilla soup you've ever had.